Today, we're going to learn 30 terms in English that are really common in negotiations. Agreement. The two parties came to an agreement after weeks of negotiations. Bargaining. Bargaining is an important aspect of any negotiation. Deal. In order to reach a deal, both parties had to make compromises. In order to reach a deal, both parties had to make compromises. A contract. Before starting any work, we always sign a contract with our clients. Before starting, before starting, before starting any work, we always sign a contract with our clients. Counter offer. After the initial offer, we submitted a counter offer to the other party. Deadline. The deadline for signing the contract is tomorrow. The deadline for signing the contract is tomorrow. Deal. We closed a great deal with the supplier for our raw materials. Dispute. The dispute between the two companies was eventually resolved in court. The dispute between the two companies was eventually resolved in court. Impasse. The negotiation reached an impasse when neither side would budge on their demands. Incentive. The company offered an incentive to employees who met their sales targets. Mediation. Mediation was necessary to resolve the disagreement between the two parties. Successful. Good negotiation skills are successful for any successful business. Countered. The seller made an offer and the buyer countered with a different price. Delivery. We have different options for shipping, including express and standard delivery. Penalty. There will be a penalty if the work is not completed on time. Negotiable. The price of the product is negotiable. Proposal. We submitted a proposal to the client outlining our plan or the project. Quantity. We need to order a specific quantity of materials for this project. Quota. Our company has a quota for how much waste we are allowed to produce. Reciprocity. 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 Reciprocity is an important principle in business negotiations. Rejected. Unfortunately, the other party rejected our offer. The settlement agreement was signed after the two parties agreed to the terms. Terms. The terms of the contract were not clear, so we had to clarify them with the other party. Trade-off. In negotiation, there is always a trade-off between time, cost, and quality. In ultimatum. The other party issued an ultimatum, which made negotiations difficult. Suppliers. We have an understanding with our suppliers about the quality of the materials we receive. Valuation. Valuation is important in determining the worth of a company or asset. 
a warranty. We provide a warranty on all of our products to ensure customer satisfaction. A win-win situation. A win-win situation is the ideal outcome of any negotiation.